Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. It's about three o'clock on a Monday right now. I have been working since nine. I finished working for the day, so now I wanted to pick up the camera and start vlogging. I don't really have much going on today, but I did have some things I wanted to do around the apartment. I have new decor pieces, like new um, wall art that I just got in the mail. I have a big package from Ikea, kind of just like little small things. I didn't get any furniture or anything like that. And I also have some clothing hauls I wanted to like Unbox. I have to do some cleaning so I'll clean my bathroom and my bedroom and I know you guys like watching that So I wanted to vlog that and speaking of apartment decor I know you guys have been waiting on an official apartment tour and I think what I'm gonna do Unfortunately, I'm gonna wait until after Christmas to do that because I plan on decorating my apartment soon for Christmas I'm gonna put up my Christmas tree either this week or next week whenever I have time and I don't want my like official apartment tour to be Christmas version of it. I want it to be like the normal decorations So I think I'm gonna wait until January to do that. Sorry to keep you guys waiting But I want it to be absolutely perfect because that video is gonna be on my channel forever I want it to be perfect. I don't want any Christmas decor in it. I want it to be like my normal decor. I still have more things I want to do so um, I, I just want it to be complete before I finish it. So that's an update on that. The office is crazy messy right now. It's going to be a busy time for my YouTube channel for filming because I have here, this is my pile of Christmas gifts. I'm making a gift guide for her. I'm gonna film that this week whenever I have time. And then this is everything I wanna unbox today. This is my Ikea package, my huge ASOS haul. I have the November glossy box to show you guys. It's so cute, I already took a peek inside and it's really nice. And then I also have a bag here. This is a bag of makeup that my friend, who's actually my neighbor, she lives right below me, it's so funny. Her name's Leisha and she works with this company, Pharmacy. And the makeup is so cute. She gave me this bag full of makeup. In terms of like an update of what I want to do for decor, I need to fill this shelf out. So right now it's kind of random. Like I have a couple empty spots and then I have my purses here. I'm thinking I'm going to put my purses on this shelf. I think I'll have to put my purses there because this wall is so bad. If you guys watched my office makeover video, I think it was a couple months ago, I had trouble hanging these floating shelves. I had three of these floating shelves. I like nailed one here, I nailed one here, and I nailed one there. And this wall has absolutely no wood in it. It's just plain drywall, so it does not support these floating shelves. It just started falling apart, so I just took it down. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end up taking that one out. I'm gonna fill the holes, I'm gonna paint over it. And I bought a wall art from Desenio. And it's like the Prada Mar Marfa sign. So I got that in the mail today. I'm gonna put that up today. It's a shame that like these shelves don't stay up. You can tell it's like slanted. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Ikea. I got this frame and this is for an artwork, a poster that I got from Desenio Posters. And this is gonna go in my bedroom. So I think this was only like $10. I picked up two more of these candles that I got when I went in store like a month ago. And it's just these vanilla scented candles they smell so good and i just like how minimal it is i think this was each like 1.99 two dollars each so i just wanted to get a couple more this is the next thing i got it's a cute little circular vase and i feel like this is also something you could get at like the dollar store too um but i thought it was cute how they pictured it online they put like a little like one stem flower in there it looked so cute so i think i might use this for like a flower maybe next to my vanity or i could even use this as like a little trinket bowl i got this vase i really liked again the minimal style i think this was only 8.99 i got this candle i thought it was so pretty it comes in this glass jar and the box first of all the packaging very very pretty this would make a really nice gift i feel like for christmas time so gorgeous this is definitely gonna go on like my vanity or somewhere cute Mmm, mm, it smells good. It smells like it smells like blossoms. I got this glass bowl. It's kind of like a well, it's a box. It's shaped as a bowl, but it has a lid. And I thought this could be used for a bunch of different things. It's a really good size. I just love this look. I love the all glass like aesthetic, like these type of things. I think it's so classy. So I will get a lot of good use out of this. I'm gonna use this for so much, and I think this was like five dollars. And this is a little. I don't know what you call this shape. I thought I could put this on my vanity and I think this is the same like style as this one almost. The design I mean. These two were each 99 cents. Again, this is another thing you could probably get from the dollar store, but 
I think it's cute. I like how minimal it is. So that's all I got from Ikea. I've been getting a lot, if not all, of my wall art from Decennial lately. I love their prints. I think they're just so my style. I have like five prints from them. That's the one where I also got the Prada one that I talked about earlier. So I'll show you guys all that. And so here's the print. I love it. It's like a, a female figure. So we're going to put that in here. I'll do that later and hang that up later. I want to show you guys next the November Glossy Box. Here is the inside. Here's everything that comes in it. The main item is this palette from LA Splash. And it's an eyeshadow palette. I love the design of it. A bunch of nudes and browns and golds. Very pretty colors that I could use every day. So this is a nice little palette to have. There's also a brush. A blender brush from Spectrum Zodiac. Oh, I see what they're doing here. This is like Zodiac themed. Just a nice blending brush. Could always use a blending brush. There's also an eye eyeliner from a brand called Duce, but it's just a black liner. And there's also a couple of patches in here. These are Mighty Patch, your blemish hero. They're invisible. Like it helps for pimples. You can put it over any blemishes or anything. Wow, that's awesome. It says whether you're at work, school, or on the dance floor, feel confident with invisible. So I guess you can wear this when you're at work and at school, like in public, and it's invisible. That's interesting. I'm going to have to try that soon next time I get a, a blemish. And then here is some eye masks from Wander Beauty. There's some gold eye masks. That's all for the November box. Another good one. And you guys can use my code to get a discount on your first box. I'll link that in the description. So thank you, Glossy Box, for sending me this month's box. And now for my ASOS haul. And I got mostly sweaters and I got some winter accessories. I'm starting to buy like scarves and hats and getting ready for winter. This first one is this gray crew neck sweater. This is from the New Look brand. And it's just your plain, nice essential. It's a really nice material but i got a size large because i like oversized fit for my sweaters this sweater is kind of a beige color and it's another kind of crew neck style wow i feel like these are all the same colors this one is a lighter color this one is more i think this one is actually a beige color this other one was like a more of like a tan caramel color um so this one has a nice mock neckline this also feels really soft and then the next things i got are hats and scarves i got this hat which i don't know why i got this this is a little bit expensive but i kind of like the look of it it's just it's a plain white hat with this black writing this brand fiorushi it's an italian brand and i had never heard of it but i looked it up and apparently it's like a really popular italian brand and I don't know, I just like the look of, of, of a beanie with this white font on it. And then I got a plain black one. I needed a, a plain black one. I have a lot that are like, have big poofy balls on it, but I don't have like a plain, plain black one. And this next scarf is so cute. It has my initial on it. They have all the initials on the website and it's a nice beige color. And then it has your initial on the lower corner and it's an oversized scarf so it's one of those super big ones so soft it's gonna be so warm in the fall i love big scarves like this i think they're so chic and fashionable and they keep you warm like it's personalized how cute is that so yes oh i love that it's gonna be cute for winter and lastly is just this plain gray scarf this one is another huge one it's so soft so cozy i love scarves like this so like when i'm walking in the winter i can just like pull it up okay so that's all that i got from asos okay so i wanted to show you guys now the pharmacy goodies that i got from my friend so the biggest thing in here is this nudes lip gloss set so that looks super nice i'll swatch one of them it is a really nice consistency so there's some more lipsticks liquid lipsticks there's a lot of different shades i love shades that are this color wow so pretty it's like a dark nude that one on the bottom this one down here the lighting is kind of weird but it looks like it's like purpley and there is a eyeshadow primer they have they have a matte oh this is a matte lipstick consistency is great wow that's a really pretty pink there is a mascara extreme curl mascara which i know their mascaras are really good because i've seen 
my friend on her story try it on and it looks really good there's a primer it's a camera ready lip plumper oh ooh, i'll try this Ooh, it's like a nice gloss there's another mascara this one is the double lash extend nice brush and then there's these palettes one of them is an eyeshadow palette it's halloween themed and then there's two face palettes this one is the three in one face palette so there's a bronzer highlighter and blush Ooh, this highlighter is really pigmented oh, this is a weird angle i'm trying to show you my hand but it's the three shades here and then this is the peach bite face palette oh these are pretty oh i like that blush color it's like a peachy color and then the halloween palette oh these are perfect not even just for halloween but like for regular use so pigmented those are really pretty colors i really like that middle one that like corally color there's also a couple lip liners i believe and i used this darker one it's like a brownish color and that one looked so good with like my nude lipsticks i'll swatch both of these the brown one is 227 and then the kind of lighter more nude one is 223 both of those on the bottom there those are nice neutral colors check them out and i'll link the links in the description thank you so much alicia for giving me these goodies i'm excited to try everything out all right so there it is hung up i feel like i hung it a little bit too high i might move it down a bit but i just don't like to put too many holes in my wall but anyway, regardless, it's still really cute, and the frame actually came with, like, a scratch. So, I mean, you get what you pay for. This was, like, $10 from Ikea, so. Anyway, it's still cute. I really love the print, and I like the white frame, and I think it goes well with my other two frames. My other Desenio ones are here, and this is the other Desenio print that I got. This one is smaller. This is, I think, 12 by 16. I thought it was very fitting for the bathroom and my bathroom is like black and white details I have black and white everywhere and then I also have these black and white art prints here these are from Amazon and then the frames are from Michaels I just need little touches here and there around my apartment and then I can finally film my apartment tour but I just feel like I have a lot of wall space that I still need to fill up so I'm slowly slowly getting there so now I'm at Michaels and I need to get a frame for the other Prada print that I got from my office. And also this will be a good sneak peek to see what they have for Christmas. Where are they? Do they not have any? Oh yeah, okay. Yes, yes, this is it. This is it. I need 20 by 28. Yay, okay, found it. Guys, there's so many Christmas decorations already. I'm freaking out. I've seen so many TikToks about the like acrylic ones and how people are decorating those. They're like doing DIY acrylic decorations. Maybe I'll do that this year too. Oh my God, these are cute. I like this little white one. My Christmas decor last year was all white. So I'm gonna do that again this year. Also, everything is 40% off. All Christmas decor is 40% off. All right, we'll have to come back this week. But here's a little sneak peek for you guys. patched up all the holes I have to wait for the pink to turn white that's how you know it's dry so I'll sand it down after and then I'll hang up the sign where is it there it is and it looks so cute so while I'm waiting for the paint to dry I'm gonna clean up my bathroom in my bedroom because I just really want to tackle it I haven't cleaned my bathroom in like maybe almost two weeks
bathroom is all clean looking beautiful and I wanted to show you guys the products I use I've shown these a couple times before but I always want to mention them every time I clean because they're just so amazing so the majority of my products are from infuse clean I got this little caddy it's so convenient especially if you have a lot of the products because they have the different slots for the pods and so there are three different sprays I have the blue is for the windows and glass and the green is for the bathroom for like toilet bowls um, sinks and stuff in the bathtub and then the purple is multi-purpose you can use it on any surface so I usually use this on the counters of my kitchen and they are reusable so when the water is done you just pop a new one in you fill the water up to the fill line and then it's ready to go and then I also have the floor mop which is for wood floors it's the same concept you put a capsule in and then you fill the water up and then when it's done you just replace it with another capsule the pads are really cool because these are velcroed on you can take it off and wash it so it's reusable you don't have to like change it every time someone asked me to do a skincare collection because I have so many things on my little stand the stand first of all is from Amazon up here I have all of my ordinary products I talked about these all the time in all my videos so I won't go through that because you guys have heard me talk about it a lot I have my Kate Somerville serum my Cora glow oil my Isle of Paradise self tanning drops my pharmacy eye cream and then my rodile sculpting gel I have the rodile vitamin C serum or no not serum cleanser it's a gel cleanser from peach and lily and I have a bunch of other cleansers I have the Ole Hendrickson one the Kate Somerville cleanser the rodile cleanser water I have for Sally's quench moisture serum and I have a moisturizer from the ordinary um, these two are toners from fresh and Ole Hendrickson in. And down here I have some more frequently used ones. This is the refreshing spray and this is the cleanser or it's a peeling peeling gel. And then I have a bunch of stuff from Glossy Box's skincare line. I have their hydrating mist. That is the cleanser. This is the night serum. That's the moisturizer. Origins ginseng scrub cleanser. And then I have a few makeup removers and then this is my soap for my lash extensions or for my eyes I have to use a special soap for my eyes so that my lashes don't fall out and then I have my Clinique moisturizer and then my Clinique foaming cleansing mousse and in here I don't really have much honestly I mainly just have all of my eye gels I have like a face mask in here I have my like cooling eye gel mask and my quartz roller and then I do have this herbivore glow brightening mask um, and then I have this serum from Clinique and then I have a Clinique eye cream which I do use a lot and then I have my glow moisturizer so yeah there you go there's my little mini skincare collection I've put the two glass things from Ikea I just put in random things like my little charms and bracelets and stuff and I ended up putting the other little jar in my bathroom and I just put all the little small stuff the like skinny tall things I put in here I'm waiting for the spackle to dry I just ordered pho because I didn't feel like cooking tonight it's also Monday and I always get so lazy on Monday nights because I just worked all day it looks so good I'm eating at my living room table because I wanted to watch TV I'm watching new girl of course I really need to find new shows I'm the type that like will stick to a show but it makes me feel happy and comfortable and it's gonna be soothing while I eat my very soothing pho. The print is hung. I had to wait for the paint to dry because I put spackle on it and I sanded it down and then I painted over it so all the disgusting horrible holes are gone and I really like how the print looks I think I kind of like that better than the shelves anyway so yeah I put all my other purses on the shelf over here cleaned up my office a little bit this is gonna just have to stay there until I get to film my video alright guys so I'm going to end the vlog right here it's about nine o'clock but I am so sleepy I think I'm honestly gonna get ready for bed and go to sleep early tonight I hope you guys enjoyed this day in my life vlog and thank you so much for watching I'll see you guys in my next one.